Williams is a liberal blogger who went from. Hart Williams, Hart Williams is a liberal blogger who went. From Hart Williams. Whether it's a fiscal cliff, a Tea Party, or going gold, there's an underlying philosophy that's been increasingly moving American and world politics. My ideas are my property. We see its effect in the headlines every day. A philosophy of extreme individualism that seems like a call to anarchy. It was born in the aftermath of the Russian Revolution and the fanatical anti-communist sentiment of the Cold War. It's expressed in the novels Atlas Shrugged and The Fountainhead. It's expressed in such essays as The Virtue of Selfishness. And increasingly, it's expressed in the speeches on the floor of the United States Congress. I read, it's required reading in my office for all my interns and my staff. We start with Atlas Shrugged. Uh, the reason I got involved in public service, um, by and large, if I had to credit one thinker or one person, it would be Ayn Rand. This is the philosophy of writer Ayn Rand, and the subject of a new e-book by Hart Williams entitled Ayn Nation Under God. Rather than attempt to sort out all the threads of what is called libertarianism, Ayn Nation Under God takes a look at the core conception that drives this movement. The notion that every individual human being is completely sovereign. We or, to paraphrase Abraham Lincoln, each one of them was born in the log cabin they built themselves. We are approaching a world in which I cannot permit myself to live. Author Hart Williams has been a literary critic for decades. But this is not book criticism. A philosophy major at university, this is not a book of philosophy. He's always been funny, and this has that, but most of all, Iron Nation Under God is a respectful look at the philosophy espoused by Ayn Rand and her followers, and a somewhat gleeful dismantling of the core notions of their movement. We own this country. We own this country.